folks out here, allthingsindustry.com. And one of the things I want to show you was uh, we have an Empress CAD uh, premolar crown. So what I did was we adjusted uh, the big picture things with uh, a diamond. And then now what we're going to do is I just use, making sure I know where my, con you know, sort of staying away from the contact area, use this heatless wheel just to kind of get rid of the big scratches from the diamond that I was using. Right. Still a little more to go with that. The next stage was to use a medium paste. This is called diachine. Uh, it sort of gives you that rough. It looks like blush. The dental system is about to start putting it on her face. I'm like, whoa. So that's going to crank it up to a little bit of really decent speed. Apply pressure like that. Use a hard bristle brush. We've gotten rid of most of all the big scratches from the uh, diamonds that I was using. So that's that gives us a rough sheen. And then what we're going to use is the fine. So again, this is uh, dye sheen fine. This is where the magic begins. Really high, high RPM and just some pressure. Okay. Here, can I, can I have that? Well, I guess you did. I mean, she'll have to put it in a room. in the situation is the pre-molar. Happy with our occlusion. And once it's milled, you can just adjust it and then polish it and not have to refire it. That gives you an idea where we went. It's amazing. Amazing, amazing. But just a, but instead of using those old gray things that we taught, uh, hope that helps. Cheers.